This test is the Lea grating acuity test. Now the gratings don't have a handle so that we can show these gratings in different orientations and ask the child in which direction the lines are. Uh, and so this becomes a discrimination test. Now we train first. Can you tell me in which direction the lines are here? Straight. Are they up and down? Yeah, you show with your finger very well. And this was easy. Okay, then if I show this, so in which direction are the lines now? Yeah, they're lying down. In which direction are they now? Can you put your hand in this direction? Um, and if I put uh, their lines like this, in which direction are they now? Yeah, very good indeed. And if they are, then I put them in this direction. So in which direction are they now? Very good. Then we can start making the measurements when we can do the test. You see this still very well, don't you? What is the direction of the lines now? Mm -hmm. And what is the direction of the lines now? Mm -hmm. Then I have so fine lines. And in which direction are the lines now? Do I need to come a bit closer? Can you see uh, in which direction? Very good. Then I can go further away. In which direction are they now? Are they up or, or tilted? Mm -hmm. And in which direction are they now? Great. And in which direction are they now? And in which direction are they now? Let's say, yeah, that was also very correct. And this way? Uh, so uh, she's answering at this distance, which uh, we would normally have a tape measure on the floor so that I would get the distance exactly because uh, as a function of the distance I know then how many lines there are per one degree of uh, visual angle. And this way we get the grating acuity measured very easily simply by going further away and coming closer. 